online and on your smart speaker. Townsville's national award-winning builder, Kia Constructions. Hit News Briefing. Hi, it's Dan Flake here with your news briefing. The PM's directly apologised to former Liberal staffer and alleged sex assault victim Brittany Higgins on the first sitting day of Parliament in 2022. Scott Morrison saying sorry to all victims of bullying, sexual harassment and sexual assault across the sector over the years. He's also vowing his government will adopt the findings of the Jenkins report into parliamentary culture. There's been a little over 50 COVID-related deaths recorded across the country today. Meantime, Queensland has some good news, surpassing the 90% double-dose vaccination mark. Remaining in the Sunshine State and authorities say its fortress Queensland reputation won't stop international travellers choosing to visit when borders open later this month. Health Minister Yvette Darth says exemptions will be likely granted for the unvaccinated in some cases while the WellCamp quarantine facility will be available if needed. Not at all. I believe they will look at Queensland and actually be amazed at the low numbers of COVID that we we have had in this state since the start of the pandemic, low hospitalisation rates, how well we have managed this. And aged care workers are rallying in Australia today as concerns continue about the state of the sector. But now with Omicron, we have aged care nurses and workers dealing with the crisis of understaffing, not enough PPE and rapid antigen tests, and of course underpaid workers and a refusal to implement urgently the Royal Commission recommendations. The ACTU is Michelle O'Neill. Introducing the Staria Load, Hyundai's new commercial van that fits in everything, and now it even and comes loaded with a $1,000 bonus for Rabian holders. Test drive today. Veteran prop James Slipper could soon become our most capped player after he re-signed with Australian Rugby, the 32-year-old recommitting to the Brumbies until the end of the 2023 season. Wallabies coach Dave Ronnie says it's massive for the squad. He's big defensively. He's, he's got a bit of a mean streak in him around the clean out. And, yeah, so look, he's, he's, he's been huge and... Um, yeah, it's a great signing and great to see him stay longer. Ashes team Mostly sunny and 31 in Townsville for the rest of today, down to 23 degrees tonight. Tomorrow, mostly sunny and 32 degrees. Our listener app is the home of radio, podcasts, music and news. Join up to listen live or on demand now.